welcome back to the channel and today we have a slimy worm worms feature a lot on my channel and they somehow end up in my venus fly traps this particular worm is a giant it measures about five inches long and can my venus fly trap cope with such a large prey as you can see, I do get a lot of them in my Venus flytrap room, the den. They often crawl around sundews and appear in the soil. But this one is a whopper. It's not long before the trap snaps shut and the worm is already trying to make a great escape. Worms have no hard skeleton so their bodies can squash and stretch and twist under pressure and their muscles work in waves allowing them to push forwards even when tightly gripped by the fly trap. But the worm's body is also slippery with a mucus, reducing the friction inside the fly trap, allowing it to ooze and slime and sometimes escape. Worms also go up against some of my other carnivorous plants, such as these sundews. And the slime possesses no ability to catch them, and the worm just tries to find its way into the soil. It usually causes more damage to the traps and the plants than any other creature in the den. This video was originally filmed in 8K macro, super high detail, to capture all of these gruesome and awesome shots. As the worm continues to slime and squeeze out of the trap, it's starting to become obvious. I think it's just too big. Smaller worms can sometimes get caught, but these big worms, well, they are just too powerful and just too slimy, and they can easily escape a Venus flytrap. Thanks for watching, Mr. Naked Landscaper.